in the middle of the madness. Manny Ty keeps asking to film. Yeah, it's it's to to teach you that. Yeah, Mum, your footage was diabolical. So this is the um, the omelette my dad always used to make us when we went to school, and I always say it's a bloody miracle that we had any friends because he used to put a garlic in it like that. Imagine well, everyone else. Like everyone else was well, a whole garlic. Garlic. Everyone else was having rice krispies, and we'd turn up at school having had garlic. So oh, right. fry a bit of garlic. You're one of those kids. I know those kids. A little bit of you oil. You play with them and then in the middle of play you pause and you go, ooh, you smell. Oh, it already smells delicious. I love it. Whisk up your eggs. Because you know, you know that garlic is a natural antibiotic and also it has, parsley has tons of vitamin C. So the reason my dad used to do this and I and a vitamin C was it was healthy. Save you from getting the colds from the bastards that will give you a cold at school. Hmm. Yeah, the bastards like me who didn't smell of garlic. Yeah. They were playing. But you'd all have colds. Yeah. That's why, because you weren't having garlic noises. for breakfast. <laughs> you think we'd have got on at school? Yeah, you'd have really fancied me. Oh, would I? Yeah. Wouldn't you have fancied me? Yeah, I would have. No, you're just saying it. No, I would. Of course you I would. I would have thought, that to make it darling, I would have absolutely fancied you at school. Shock of blonde hair. I mean, I would have loved you. You I'd might have been, you know what you'd have, have irritated me just as much as you do now. Look, see what Mikey just said? That smells so nice. Look, guys. Okay. So it goes in. What are you making? My dad's um, garlic, parsley garlic omelette. Did you hear this sarcastic one? A little said, pepper on top. Oh, wow, it looks fantastic. It's so it? nice. It's so easy. It's so quick and it's really good for you. So you just push. That very the egg that's cooked into the now. middle. Is your dad that professional? No. And then you just keep doing that. Keep pulling it forward, rolling it round. You get like this ribboned omelette. Oh, it's so gorgeous. Kiki's going to have some. Am I? Yeah. And then, don't flip it, you turn it really low. And it steams it, steams Yay! the rest of it cooked. Looks fantastic. So I wanted to ask you, who did, when did your dad work with Sam Wanamaker? On Sinbad and the Eye of the yeah, There you go, because oh, Sam Wanamaker has a big part in Tarantino's new film. And I kept squealing everywhere. Ah, oh, Teddy's worked with him. Teddy's Sam worked with him. Sam Wanamaker does. Yeah, Sam someone Wanamaker playing dead. Sam Wanamaker. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. And the good thing is about this is, like, Mark and Nanny Die love a runnier egg. We don't. So what you can do is you can just cut it into your, and we were always like this as a family. Some of us wanted to get granny and some of us didn't. And then you can just... Oh. Would you say, I mean, I have to confess, your life, your childhoods were far more involved with food than most normal people. I mean, most normal English families aren't as obsessive about food as you are. It's are you? I mean, don't it's not... obsessive, it's no, just no, no, as part, I mean, no, part of it's life. Feeding people. It's like the Italian... Yeah, but that's the Brits. You go to Italy, you go mm. to France, you go to any other country, yeah, yeah, and the yeah. food is a big part of family. Yeah. It's not just us. I mean, you could all sit and talk about aubergines for half an hour, and I just lose the words of it. Just a little taste. What's, what it's really, really nice with, if we had now, is some fresh tomatoes with a bit more parsley and olive oil, but we haven't got any. In my fridge at home, I have actually got fresh tomatoes. Can you oh, believe that? They're, good. they're about they're be six fresh. weeks old. They're not going to be fresh now. Go and get them. Come on, now, go on the train and get them. Go. Give me a spoon. Get them. I need to ask you a question. Oh, mm. Go on, ask. No. I can really taste the parsley and the garlic. <laughs> Delicious. I can't tell you how much nicer yeah. it is with sliced tomato. It's shame. It's yum. <laughs> is it hot? Is it too hot? I'll try it. Is it banging around your mouth? Is it full of flavour? Is that real food? I don't think I've tasted real food for weeks. Do you want some smoked salmon with it? Now you have last year, actually. Do you want some smoked salmon with it? Mm -hmm. Sure, you might like that. Don't just say no. You say no without thinking. I'm not hungry. Like no, it. no. It's not a question of liking. It's a question of smoked salmon with it, Mark. Yes, please. I can imagine smoked salmon would add to it, but I don't yeah, want it because it's all me. This is I'm just going to go and check that the, uh, the lovely family aren't coming to get their stuff. So we've got other stuff that we want them to take. No, they haven't come yet. So they're coming this afternoon. Oh, I love that. And that might make such a world of difference to their home, their house. 
we've got some toys there. I don't know if I saw a little girl in the family, but I love that. I love that something that we're going to throw out is going to be make, you know, because it's nice quality doors. Oh, God. Right. So, bouncing around the house now. We're in this corner. I'm just detangling all this stuff. Are there any other blokes out there who find that in the necessary cabling system of any home entertainment system, the discovery of fairy lights is really <laughs> annoying. Medina's. Just get them out. I love them. I know, but they hang over things, they go in things. I love them. I love the fairy lights because I'm practically a fairy. Unless it's fairy lights with an HDMI cable. Fairy. I'm a fairy Do god. Not. I'm a Do fairy not. god. <laughs> mean it's still you now in a row that's exactly Chin do your arms again fairy. do your arms again Chia fairy. no do your arms in front of you Chu not a fairy. that's how you row <laughs> anyway fairy lights are being annoying this is my world this is my effing world and then in the middle of it all you're going round trying to pull everything out pull everything out and then in the middle of it all you're pulling all the stuff out. You come out with these bloody things. <laughs> the f is that? And what's it doing in there? How long has it been there? It takes, it's not like it's small. Happy Dina. Trying to find the right fitting end, screwdriver end for your screwdriver is a very, very manly pursuit. It requires all sorts of testing, adjustments. Are you bringing up your part again, are you? Huh? Are you bringing up your part again? No, I'm just talking about manliness. I just, I, I like to get That's in touch I mean. with these manly things. Bigging up my part, what do you mean, being a man? Just because you can bend over and immediately deliver <laughs> doesn't mean you're great. Oh, it's really sexy, don't say it. I didn't say it like that. You come straight in like that. But I'm just bending over. I'm not thinking about my cleavage. Yeah. Don't, just stop saying bend over. <laughs> it's just impossible. Mark, you can't give any of that in. What? And I'm telling you now. Divorce. <laughs> as soon as you say divorce, I find a way around it. Mark's been disgusting again, Nanny Di. He is! You brought him up! No, you can't I... lift your hands, raise your hands and say you had nothing to do Maybe with she it. She can't actually lift her hands. <laughs> what are you doing? Yay! You think you're doing a good job here, babe. What is... I mean, that is from a Wii. Oh we no, hang hear. on. That's from the Wii. No, isn't that... doesn't that give us extra sound? No, that's what makes us be able to go with joysticks. I think it gives us extra sound. No, this is part of our Wii. Oh, you've done a brilliant job at die. He's done the job we all hate. Oh, you've wow. seen what he's done? Which job? Well, that. You've sorted all that shit out. Oh. That's so boring. Oh, I'm so excited we can hoover it. It's not just boring, oh, well. I mean, it's incomprehensible. It's incomprehensible. <laughs> um. Um. Yeah. So what's the plan? But well, the thing is, you need to get in, in here and hoover then. Go and sit over there and see what the telly looks like from over there. It looks very good, but let me Never sit it. down. You've got to be at a lower point to see That's if it's it. too high. You were worried it was going to be too high. I sit in the dog <laughs> <button. laughs> I'm sitting in the what? dog house. <laughs> She's in the dog house. That's good. You're in the dog house. It's perfect. Oh, look, her top is a bit confused. Oh, the dog's not Oh, like you're it. in our oh. dog house. What do you think of the telly up there? It's actually perfect. Is it? Yeah. Well, yeah, it will be, I know it will be. I'm holding the telly. I'm not touching the screen. Why is it going on? Um... What is, is it filming? I don't know, how do I know? Is the number moving up? Yes. Is it yeah. ticking? Yes, it's ticking, nine, 60. Yeah. I've got both of you in shots. Okay, I'm holding the telly. Mark's, you've just got his, the side of him. Yeah, it's all cool. Holding the telly. Yeah, I'm holding the telly. Keep 
Holding the telly. Holding the I'm telly. I'm holding the telly. Is Mum definitely in focus? How do you make it in focus? Well, no, I mean, can you see us? Yes. <laughs> you sure? Of course. It's perfect, I think, in that respect. I hope so. Hold the telly. I'm holding the fucking telly. <laughs> it's at a dangerous point now. He's picking up his part and then he done. Okay. What are you actually doing? Come right here, Nanny Dine, show them what he's doing. Okay. He's being very manly. He's got his screwdriver. Well, very manly, but it's, it's not actually, actually working. Let me ask us, this is what's actually Can you happening. see me? No, hold on. There he is. There he is. <laughs> Shall I hold the telly? Hold the telly. There's a load of, <laughs> there's a load of wires. Holding the telly? Yeah, I'm holding, holding the effing telly. Nanny is slowly losing the will to live. Um, just do you see Look, I'm holding the telly. I'm just look. trying to crack my skull open. Look, on it. Subs, look at all those points. Now, I don't think you can clean the telly with spray, can you? This no. Much? Really this is my. Okay. Really holding very... the telly. Yeah, I'm holding, holding the telly. telly. This is really annoying. Oh, God, I've almost got a Tarantino shot. I've got Mark on one side and his reflection on the other side. Well done. God, Mark. <laughs> this is incredible. You're quite oh. something. So, Subs, we love check it. this shit out. Yeah. Ta -da. Ta -da -da. We've Look recycled. We've recycled. As long as we put. Oh God, that's so ugly. Oh no, you have to put books on What's that so side ugly? or something. Put your books on that side. Yeah. What's ugly though? Look like all the wires. The plugs. We'll but yeah, that that's oh. good, isn't it? That's yeah, really that, good. That, that, the plugs will be hidden by whatever goes in there. Yeah. Yeah. In yeah. There. Um, but doesn't that look better? It's oh my God, it's so much better. Place for the remotes on the side. It's brilliant. I think Kiki's going to like that. Huh? I think Kiki will like that. I think we should get a really cool box to what put remotes so? in because then yeah. that will stop me from putting on stuff on yeah. the top. Nobody's allowed to put anything, especially me. So if we put a box in front <laughs> of those plugs. We're banging on about this box that we all put our things in. Oh, it's so sweet. I'm going to order a remote control box. And also, just white, just just little pedestals and things for things will cover things. So if you had like just a white box that you put stuff in, like batteries. So anyway, there you go, team. And look, it's all plugged in. So the Apple TV is here. So subs, here's the big question. What should, could, must and mustn't we clean a TV screen with? Oh, yeah. Isn't it very specific what you I'm can... Really look at, I'm looking it up now. Isn't it vinegar? Isn't it vinegar? I'm sure vinegar's in there somewhere. Yeah. No, vinegar's to do with the actual... Oh, I don't think you should use vinegar. I think that's spoiler. I love vinegar. I love the smell of vinegar. <laughs> Isn't that weird? It sort of feels... Or do we get more of a frame? We're just trying to decide subs. For what? Because I was thinking we just get like a really simple frame. Bed frame. And we put the bed in on the floor. But I'm wondering if we should get it a bit higher. So they're not right on the yeah, floor. Yeah, I agree. Look, because if you get something cheap like this and then they've got drawers underneath. Yes, I agree. Shall we do that subs? Yeah, I agree. That's £118. So we need three of those. I'm going to try and find a cheaper one. But yeah, that's a good idea because then there's storage. Yeah. This is rocking. You know what I'm going to actually do now? I'm going to pull off the wall an old telephone wire system that has really annoyed me for years. I wonder if they've been to collect their stuff yet. No, not yet. It looks so cool coming into the room this way. Look at it there. Look, look over there. Look, look. I'm going to turn you around. And I'm going to, you're going to be me. Look at that. Look. Tell you what, we've lucked out with that thing. Yes? That looks proper, like, meant to be. I know. It was my idea, you've forgotten that. No, I know, it was your idea. It's I great. Said it ages do you know why? Do you know why we got that originally? It used to have all my records in it. Oh, look at this. We could put the Technics desk, desk there and Technic records in it. We could put the Technics desk there. We could put the Technics desk there. What's the matter with you? We could, put a, we could have a stereo, we could have I've music. Lost that. Why don't I we have love a, you can have a music box here. Well, we've got one. We've got the bloody Apple box. No, but you'd like to put your vinyl yeah, on. Mark, well, look at this. What do you think about this? I've got this £215 from Ikea. Look, that. Mark! That. And then they've got a bit of arms. Or... This one, which I think is a really good price, look, £280. Uh, 
that I can see needing a smaller than what we've got mattress. But you get the mattresses with it. Day bed we with two mattresses. We are not buying more effing mattresses. The whole point of this exercise is actually, yeah, but the whole point of this exercise is to why find things to put you... the mattresses on, not buy things why with do... more mattresses. Why do they give you two mattresses? But isn't it good? Look at it. Yeah, it's good, but we look they... at it. That would look so cool. It's kind of New York Soho housey. Look at those underneath. So you're suggesting we we can only do that if we throw a mattress out. Oh, I see. Then it folds out to a double bed. Imagine they could put it out and stretch out for the for the sofa. I thought that we were trying to find a cost-effective way of making use of the mattresses we've got. I know, what but about, that's so I good. Yeah, we're going to get, get you a bed. <laughs> no, don't come out here and say, oh, you've not achieved anything. I'll yeah. beat you over the head. I don't really get people who have foot fetishes, do you? Oh, if you put that in, I'm going to be... I'm not joking. You do not put those... Yes. Feet, Mark, I don't want my horrible feet. I mean it. Hey, you've made my camera dirty with Good. you. Oh, so these beds can be stacked. Chi Chi, what do you think? Mark, go measure our mattresses. I've gone into DIY overdrive. I know, I feel like I've gone into... Look, there's a telly just nestling over there. We love it. Clearing the understairs and then show us. And now and then, look, I'm going to put up some of our beautiful art. beautiful thing that this artist made for me. Yeah. Oh, it's so beautiful. And it has written within it a poem. By Shelley. By Shelley. Oh. What do you think, Subs? What do you think? The fountains mingle with the river and the rivers with the ocean. The wind of heaven mix forever. Nothing in the world is single. All things by law divine, and on it goes, and it's so beautiful. It's great yeah. artist. Yeah, it makes you want to cry. Do you remember who painted that? Yes, of oh. course. <laughs> Tell them. Him. Mark Ash made it for me. I Mark wish you could find me the poem that you did, the film that you did on the poem. What he did, did a poem for me the first couple of years we were together. Well, that's the I remade it with the same music. But we're. It's the same music. All those photos that are on our Insta on our oh, YouTube. We're, it's we're, the same we're, music, we're, okay. but yeah, not the same photos, but. Yeah, I did that. That's going to go up there. I did that for Nadia. That was her Christmas present one year. Do you remember? Yeah. Do you well, think look. you should absolutely decide that that's where it's going to go? Should yeah. we see what other ones we're going to put yeah, up as yeah, well? Yeah, yeah. Now, we have a lot of art, but we don't, we don't have all of it framed. But this is most of it framed. Or, and here's the thing, art sounds like it costs a lot. But actually, a number of these paintings are by co-graduates of Izzy's from university. And we've got a couple next door, actually, of her works. Um, so we're now just deciding where to put things. People, I bet so many of the subs will hate our art. Look at that. Isn't that clever? I love Bought that. Bought that from a university student. Young artist. Really cool. And this one? That's inspired by Ophelia diving We've into an ocean. Had this up. We used to have that up. We might have to paint, repaint the frame. Oh, Show the this. Damien Hurst. This is Damien Hurst. Check this we out. We actually saw the real one of this. We went to the exhibition. It was just, it was so beautiful. We had to go into this tiny dark room. Diamond all skull. It. They're all real diamonds. Some stockbroker bought it, didn't he? Yeah. For how much? 50 million. 50 million. The actual head. Let me snip. That didn't cost 50 million. No. Uh, and then in amongst there, there's a couple of Tracy Emmins down there. She's always sort of fiddling with herself in her paintings, so we have to be a bit careful about showing those. But, you know. Fiddling with herself. No, I mean, that's what we like about her, that she fiddles. <laughs> oh, that looks good. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. I thought it might appeal to your neatness. I thought it was yeah, quite it's neat. Good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good, isn't it? I'm going to bring the PS3 back in or the PS4 into here and the PS3 in there. And then you can play games with friends. Yeah. Would you like that? Would you have play it if I had the PS4 in here? Yeah. So there's no peace for the wicked. It's now 5 p.m. and our bid to almost what transform the house in the space of three hours. We're now heading to B&Q to get some stuff to put pictures up. And uh, where are we going? Sainsbury's. I might cook tomorrow some pudding. I might cook some chocolate chip cookies, but you're not wow. gonna be here. You're gonna have gone, aren't you? So uh, our lovely friend Miranda and Nadia's parents are coming over tomorrow, so that'd be nice. And I'm doing lots of things in the garden, and as usual, it looks like you, you work for hours and hours and hours, and then it looks like you've done nothing, but in fact, I have done a lot. Have you? Have I you think... done any weeding? No, I haven't got that far yet. There's no more of the day left, Mum. Oh, no. That's the trouble with the day. Might have to get up enough. early. Might have to do our green figured hill in the morning. I don't quite know what we can do tomorrow because it's a bit more... What we've got with the garden is a lot more weeding yeah. and a lot more sort of defining of stuff. It's like Nadia's homed in on the one thing. Which is what? That is a problem. Which, which is, what? is what's going to happen to the ground between the new bed and the hot tub. 
That looked very white. <laughs> hey, you're back. Just talking about the aces right. in the gut. We're talking about gardening. And I came out with the phrase, it's like they'll look like a pea on a drum. Is that a phrase? It's not, Subs, is it? It's absolutely I'm nonsense. pretty certain that's a phrase. He's insisting that my dad, i.e. his granddad, used to say it as a phrase. But it's, it's like, uh, so it's about something looking very small. I know what it's... On I'm, a big expanse. Yeah. No, I which, if you think about a pea on a drum... Yeah, but pea on a drum doesn't make any sense at all. Well, it's like a pea on a drum. I mean, it, I mean imagine a pea on a drum. No, no, it gives the impression of utter space around one single small solitary thing, yes. I mean, I never understood why a pea would be on a drum. But then I just thought of this woman that I knew when I was working in the college, and mm. she was an Irish girl, and she always used to say, on a pig's back, meaning, um, I think it meant everything had gone wrong. Right, and is that was, Zoe Agnew, you'd know, is that, is that an Irish phrase? Yeah. On a pig's back? Or something about a pig's back. And then my mom, Thelma, you know, who died a few years ago now, always used to say, or it, what did she used to say? It's in Dickie's Meadow. Pushing up Dickie's Meadow. No, no, it? it's in Dickie's Meadow. In Dickie's Meadow, meaning you're dead. No, no, no. It meaning, was to do with death. No, meaning it had all gone to, to pot. All, all gone to pot. Didn't mean you were dead. She always used to say donkey's years. Does she, anyone she know why say, they. Oh, no, I say donkey's years. Lots of people of my age say donkey's years. But what does it mean? I don't know, but I heard it on the TV. Is it is it the, the idea night. that donkeys live for an enormous a long time? I mean, the suggestion maybe. is a long time, isn't it? Of pee on a drum. Is, is it pee, pee on a, a pee under a bed? A drum. What could it be, though? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, that was a fair little sound. <laughs> that was an old person sound. I, I was very aware it was an old person <laughs> sound. I thought, where's the old person who just made that sound? It was so. It was a, an exhalation. It was. Oh, God. Subs, a, that's when toffee, you know you're coming to the end of your life. When toffee you makes those like noises when I she know. now moves I, position. And I was just going to do it again. I was going to go, oh. I was thinking, why am I making that noise? I don't need to. Oh, maybe, 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 Subs, when you reach yeah. a certain age, you sort of you die. To, you have to make some weird noises. <laughs> <Yeah>. I <laughs> make I, a lot more noises when, as I get older. I really go, oh, oh. men do, men moan. Well, yeah, no, Men no. sigh no, a but lot. I think women do too. No, women shriek and no, no. men sigh. I think they, they... If I had a pound for every time Nadia goes, oh! Yeah, but that's Nads. She's that's very true. loud. I think a lot of old women do, do sigh as well. Okay, let's go and get all that shit. <laughs> Next stop, recycling. So we want to get rid of all that shit and we're going to chuck it in all of those over there. And we were just talking about Once Upon a Time in America. Check out... Once upon a time in Hollywood, sorry, sorry. Check out our review on our channel elsewhere. But Nanny Dai is such a bloody advocate of movies. She went and saw it again this week to prove her point. She liked it more than us. Much, much more. And I particularly like the end, which they particularly did. Check, like. check out our review yeah. to know what we're talking about. Yeah. And if you're not a Tarantino fan, apologies. apologies. Meanwhile, we're going to get all of that unlikely into those. Don't see how it's going to happen. I don't think any of it's going to fit. <laughs> exhausted i'm exhausted i'm i'm exhausted i'm exhausted i'm hungry i'm thirsty i'm tired i don't want to put all those paintings up oh. 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 Hello, sir. i'm so exhausted i'm not doing my feet the arch of my right foot feels like it's collapsing we've exhausted ourselves, we've exhausted ourselves. anyway just taking receipt of the list of ingredients for tomorrow's lunch it's as long as my arm oh you're kidding is that a phrase yeah it's as long as my arm. Starting to doubt your phrases now, aren't yeah. you? Like yeah. a pee on a drum, it's as long as my arm. So satisfying, isn't it? Recycling. Don't you yeah. find? There is something really satisfying about it. They need to make the experience of actually putting stuff in more enjoyable. They ought to. Yeah. Like, they should play music whilst you do it. Yeah. Or something. Or get, they, get me uh, in that shot as well. Have you ever seen a smaller person? Uh, ever? No. Hang on, payback time. I did all the cabling over there, but look in here. This is like absolutely heavy. Isn't it? I've tied it all up in there. Oh, though. there's one. That's a good one. Have you, I've just done all that. Yeah, yeah. So telly's did you working. See I've tied it all up in yeah, there. Yeah, no, the cabling, yeah. Tape, and it telly says works. That. Yeah. Um, I'm just sorting out all these. It's just, just oh, look at all the girls' toys. Hang on, no. All their action oh. figures. Hundreds of pounds those things cost. You know what I'd hate if we went took those to um, a charity shop and some. Far, far middle class person bought them all. No. Yeah. Do we need it? Well, Kiki, I think the girls will love all these, especially the red lights in yeah, here. Can I just say the only problem with them is that then when they're not on, it always looks hideous. 
Because they have to be white for them not to look yeah. Message from Maddie via Kiki, Nadia. Yeah. She's staying at Anya's for dinner and then coming. But in there are two bags sorted oh. with folded duvets, pillows, oh. and extra yeah. blankets. Oh, that's odd. Why doesn't it seem any less cluttered then? What? I folded up. Look, that was all piled with all oh, duvets. Was it? Look oh, in right. there. Open oh, the cupboard. Yeah. Show the subs. I can't remember the two paintings we said we'd. Let's have a look. Oh, how organised does that look? With so room they can to literally spare. Pull them out, and the one is yeah. and one is pillows and blankets. So can we not put a load of stuff in another bag and put it in that achingly demanding Please, space? Look how much stuff I've got there to wash: oh, sheets yeah. and duvets. Oh, yeah. I'm going to put some art artworks up. No, I can't remember. Was it this one and the and the Cornish one that we said to put on that bit? Uh, yeah. Oh, that looks really nice. They're going up. Yeah, that looks lovely, doesn't it? Yeah. Isn't it? I really like it. I think I like that wall to be all paler. So what would you like? Paler frames. So subs, we're thinking of putting that up there. Yeah. That's going nice. to be drilled holes situation, that one. Yeah. Yeah. Measuring stick. Have you got a yeah. measuring stick? No, I'm not like me. Mum? Yeah. I've got something for you. Close your eyes. Your eyes closed? Yes. Sure? Should I put my hand out? Yeah, put your hand out. Okay. And open your eyes. Oh, open what it. is it? Put your bottle down. It's a box, Mum. <laughs> forky. Oh, forky! Forky! Oh, kiss! And oh, Duke and Kaboom! Boom. Show the subs. Is it for me, really? That's for you, yeah. Why didn't you shelf. give it? Oh, look, subs, Why look at this. Why didn't you give it to me before? I keep forgetting. I was going to say you've forgotten. You look, like him. subs, I adore Forky. And, um, He's a bit like you, Forky. Well, that's what you all say, I yeah, suppose. He is there you a bit. go. Don't say I don't get um, you anything. No, I won't say that. Right, I, I say to myself, I remember many years ago getting that onto there was no easy feat. Least of all because it's so effing heavy. Oh, I love that photo. Well, I love you in that photo. Jane looks so amazing. Yeah, I think you look lovely. Thank you. You all look lovely. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. In case you didn't see it properly, oh, there it is. Oh, I forgot to say tomatoes, didn't I? All the loose women. Juice, yeah, you did. We got tomatoes, though. So anyway, I've got to measure that. So it's got the two things on either side, and it's bloody heavy. So I've got to make sure that they're very sturdy and strong. I'm so guys, I'm going to be using a spirit level. I'm oh. going to be using a measuring stick, and I'm going to be using a pencil. And if I had a stepladder, I'd use the stepladder. Where's the green stepladder? I could use the green stepladder. I've seen that somewhere. Where? Where's the green step? How can we lose a stepladder? Is it up in um, um Is it in your room? Oh, it could be. Nanny Di, you are going to have to help with the ladder. Yeah, yes. you, you need to come and hold this. Now, this, what's vital about this is not just the height, yes. but the distance and the visual balance. Yes. Between it and there. All right, put it, let's put it up there and let me have a look. Well, can you come and hold it? Okay. Oh, oh God. God. You think you've got Don't land on Nanny Die, for God's sake. No, but. <sighs> what height? Um. <sighs> I think that's. Yeah, that is higher, more or less right. Go a little bit higher, let me just see. Oh, not higher. Just a little. Go lower always. There. There? Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. You can Man, have a look at it on, the, on the film now. What's that? You can't, you can't do that alone, I don't think. Oh. Oh. Maybe wait till Maddie's back so she can help me lift. Because I can't lift oh, it because my bad back. I think Sorry. you have to wait, babe. Okay. Hey, Laura, how are you feeling, Sorry. sweetie? Better. And did it look equidistant? And did it look all right compared back. to the yeah. when you're looking at it? In yeah, there. that looked good. Well, don't the great thing about those marks film. is that that's, that's where the two <laughs> hanger points are. 
How are you? So look, that's all your duvets and then all the sheets and everything. Oh, your cool. Pull them out. Cool. And come and look at this. Wait till you see this. Not the art. Oh, wow, there you are. Oh my god! What? When did that happen? Isn't that yeah. cool? Oh my god, that, that was the shelf so that was in the fancy. Doesn't it look fancy fancy? Oh, that's, I love it. <laughs> oh my god, that's so cool. Isn't it? Uh, we prefer it at that height. Yeah. Hey. Oh, it's better high for everyone, isn't it? it is. Do you like it, Mads? Yeah. Oh, look, Maddie, look. Look at Maddie with the baby. Oh, god. Happy made me see with a baby. That's when she was a Look at her ear, poor child. Look at well, you're hair. pushing it like that. That's not how her ear was.